And then Papley. Ten disposals last week on his return, but no goals. And he's bending it back. He's got the journey. Tom Papley, that was a great decision to turn down Batty because now the best celebrator in the game is getting the SCG rocking. Just paddles it forward. Should have taken the mark. Should all be behind him. This little contest. Papley drops a football as well. Keeps it in front of him. Still a chance of Swans. Papley on the left. It all got a little bit too hard, but it ended in a goal. Tom Papley closing in on 200 career goals. And he makes no mistake there, Papley. And that's as easy as you like. No problems at all from Papley. Well done. Get it back to single figures. 38 at half time it was. Look at the Carlton fans. They can't bear to watch as Papley steps to the plate and whacks it home. To make it a two goal game at the SCG. From 50 metres out, got to come back. It is, it is. It's a goal. He's got it back within two. This is hard. One on one scenario. Hunt, Papley, Penny, Papley, Papley. Long bounce. Through it goes. Swans in front. He's the man for the moment. <laughs> Career goals. This will be 199 for Tom Patley. Missed the first six games of the season with a hamstring injury. And Patley gets the second half underway with a goal. Sam Reid. In the contest, McDonald's got one round the shoulder. Sydney free kick advantage going to be taken. Patley, goal number 200 in his career, and his second goal for the night. Sends it deep over the top of Reed. Ridley's out of position. Patley loves a goal to get things underway for the Swans, and already starts celebrating. Back, throw the great sights in footy around the corner and kicks the goal as well. Dan Papley loves this scenario. That's right through the middle. Troy bottom to Heaney, working in a tight space, trying to create out towards Papley, just so quickly on the boot, and Papley strikes. The step took them on, spun around, no whistle. Swans still have it. Haywood hooks it back to a dangerous spot, lobs there. Hickey brought it down straight to Papley, and the Swans pounce again. Missed the first six rounds, Tom Papley. 16 goals, 19 so far this year, and he starts perfectly. The Swans on the board, 75 seconds in. Now, so that's the one category you'd like to lift in, the accuracy in front of goal, but uh, that was dead-eye dick stuff from Warner. As Papley, playing in the middle, gets the Swans going forward again, and the follow-up work from Papley, he'll just let fly from 50 and start the celebrations. He's only kicked the 18 goals, which is a shock. And he's involved in everything. He's going to wheel around from 45. Oh, he's got the journey. Tommy Papley. And Taylor's had eight contested possession wins. Oh, oh. Papley steals it and goals. How good is he going at the moment? <laughs> Tommy Papley, so entertaining. And he finds Franklin on the run. Stumped away, didn't hold it. Papley pounces. <laughs> And pops it home. <laughs> Could have been harder to get out of the way of that. And he blasts it long. Hayward off hands. McDonald or Papley. Papley too quick. The third goal is on offer for Tom Papley. And their big guns at forward have responded. Now Florent plotted by Noble. Reaching handball. Papley through traffic. Gets rid of him. Left foot snapper. Kick is fading back and going through. Very much reliable. And he kicks beautifully here. That's what's ahead of Tommy Papley. Yes! Two in a row. I agree with you, Richo. Mills, just looking a little more hopefully, Papley onto the boot, got a clean snap, it's there! 
He's getting further up the ground. Good space behind him. 17-4 in finals. He's given it a ride. Straight through the middle. First four to the Swans. Costly 50 and Papley's got a couple. 35 minutes since their last goal. Holding the ball. Play on. And Papley will get a look here. The little Papa will kick his first goal in the last 30 seconds of the grand final.